We've become commodity. We, we think in terms of acquiring things. Everything is about acquisitions, about commodities. We've lost, we lose the appreciation of two key points that the biggest and most important things in life primarily love. But the same thing is truth and God and soul cannot be acquired and cannot come overnight. They're all part of a process. How many people respect process today and respect the concept of emerging realities? You plant the seed in the ground. Can you imagine it overnight suddenly turning into a tree? No, you wouldn't even expect that. You know, I'm sure someone's going to come up with some type of uh, hypersteroids to make seeds grow faster, I don't know. But you get the idea. And the second thing, it emerges. You can't force it out of the ground. It has to grow out. You can plant it, you can water it, you can do a hundred things to make it easy, to make it more conducive. But everything natural in this world works that way. Every child. Can you, a child that's just a newborn child suddenly become an adult? It doesn't work that way. So we'll look, it could be one example of a real experience that is not emerging and does not require process. But then we have a whole other artificial reality. We build machines. And there, yes, we press a button. We're so not in touch with the rhythms. You want tomatoes or cherries or any fruit? You don't need to wait for anything. You can go, they have it 24-7, all, se- all seasons. Once upon a time when you lived on a farm, you knew very well, in this season you have this fruit, in this season you don't have it. And that's that. So I'm not taking away from the advancements of our time that we have such access. You press a button, literally, and you get a delivery. With online today, we know that. Anything. So the gifts of that are obvious. But what it does is it tends to create a false reality. A false reality that we think that things can just be acquired. And things don't take a process. And then we apply that to love and to relationships and to everything else. We want it the same way. Now, no one's going to say it's exactly the same thing. You go online, J-date, you press a button, and you're suddenly married. You know? But in a, in a strange way, the way our mindsets work, we expect something similar. So then we need a little more work. You know, the... But it's still the same idea. We think in terms of control. We think in terms of um, not wanting to be vulnerable. All the things that are real, especially when it comes to love, have to do with the sparkle and the soul within.